All right, people, back for another session of Let's Play with Sylvius, doing the, the Spike Sword quest, which I did just recently in my video for um, uh, for hunting spots around face. If you look on the map here, it's right in this location. Triangle Tower is down there. The Dwarf Bridge is up here. So yeah, you can kind of see the spot. Let me actually... The, yeah, the path of, like, face is right there. So you go down here. There's some dwarfs. I'm not going to bother killing them. You need to use a pickaxe on that tile. Oh, hey, he's standing on the hole. Check that out. So, yeah, you drop down, and there are fire devils in here. All right. Legitimate throwing stars are better than throwing knives. Just slightly. So yeah, you drop down, and then you drop down in here. This is where you start fighting like two fire devils at a time, if not more. Um, I guess I want to start picking up those small pitchforks in case they're worth anything. I really don't know. So yeah, you loop down here. I already have the spike sword because I did the quest already. Some more fire devils. Take my ninja star, throwing star, whatever. Look, we all know I'm a ninja. It's all that matters. Watch as I miss repeatedly. At least he's not attacking me. There we go. Fire Devils can drop a couple of things that are semi-valuable. Guardian Shields, uh, which are also dropped by Demon Skeletons. Uh, they also drop, I think, like Necrotic Rods, which f probably are dropped by something else, but I don't know what. Alright. And now this is the fun part, where you're going to start fighting a bunch of Fire Devils, and they're going to be separated on little islands across from Papa. Uh, if you're a mage... The spell is Utana Vid, I think, for invisibility, minimum level 35. Otherwise, buy a stealth ring. You can buy stealth rings on the market. They're decently expensive, though. Uh, and if you kill these fire devils and have to buy yourself a stealth ring, you're going to not make the money back by selling the spike sword, just for the record. Oh, <laughs> man. There's no way for me to get over there and get that necrotic rod. It's it's just dead to me. Um, some people would suggest a double axe. Seriously, I mean that's not super expensive, but seriously, it's not like it's like a 300 gold item. I'm losing a bunch right now. All right, yeah. Some people would suggest just running through this quest. Uh, I think that's a little sketchy. There's a decent amount of fire devils, and I'm doing a really poor job at killing that one. Uh, yeah, there's a decent amount of fire devils, so, like, I wouldn't just... Uh, yeah, and they can apparently shoot you from off-screen. I wouldn't just run into the assumption that you'll be safe just going on a dead sprint. Let me try to see if I can just pull these guys up here. If you're fighting them, try not to fight, like, more than three at once. You're just gonna get hammered if you do. Kind of like what's happening to me right now. Also, that one's still firing at me from off the side of the screen. Maybe Ninja Stars were a bad choice. I don't know. <laughs> Gotta drink some more potion. Uh, yeah, if you stay to the, like, the left like I'm doing here, you won't have to fight the ones on the right. If you stay to the right, you won't have to fight the ones on the right. Um, on the left, obviously. Uh, I used up my last uh, throwing star. Poop. So yeah, just like try to avoid the center of the pathway. You don't really need to kill those. The quest item is right here in front of me. See how I can't step up there? Boom, boom. Yeah, the bones are empty. So now you can leave. Uh, so yeah, you don't really need to kill them all. Um, I should not have walked through that fire right there. It's a simple and easy quest, basically. Uh, if you can fight fire devils well enough. Uh, knights will definitely have a hard time because they need to keep charging into them. Uh, Mages might have a little bit of a hard time if they're low level because their HP is so low. But Fire Devils can't see through invisibility, so if you just put a stealth ring or cast that invisibility spell, you can just walk through and do whatever you want. You don't have to fight them. You can fight them. You can do whatever you want. So, that was uh, easy enough. Right? Right. I'm not going to kill these dwarves still. Alright guys, that was a simple, quick, and easy one that I actually just did twice in a row now, but whatever. Uh, like, favorite, subscribe, sell me your soul, whatever.